this is my first time. Um, okay, we're going to establish a sense of trust here, right? I'm going to tell you some personal things, and I just want to make sure that we can all trust each other. And what I say here does not leave. Do I have your trust? Yes. yes. All right. Well, um, as everyone has gone through in their childhood, you know, we all experience our bodies and whatnot, so I guess I'm going to talk about that. Um, okay. So, um, when I was 13, uh, my mom caught me masturbating, uh, <laughs> say about twice. Actually, more than twice. The first time she caught me, and the second time she, she found something. I'm going to talk about the first time she caught me. So, you know, just 13, you just go in your room, and you're just on the couch, or not even the couch, just on, just on your bed. <laughs> you're just sitting there, just making sure the coast is clear. Gets on the phone, calls all his friends, and I'm just like, 
like shit. His girlfriend walks in right behind him. She's like, ew, Keon, you're so gross. Oh my gosh, you're so nasty. And she's like, shit. So I try to spring up, but I can't, but my ass cheeks get cut to this chair. Because you know black people, we like to put plastic over all the furniture. I'm just there stuck. And I'm just like, shit. Uh, damn, there was not much of a end to that story. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, here's another here's another instance that happened to me. <laughs> Mind you, this is kind of gruesome. So um, <laughs> I'm at home once again, stroking it. <laughs> and I'm just you know I don't know. I just felt angry that day, so I was just kind of like <laughs> picturing I was stall fucking some chick going to town. And I ripped that little, you know that little sweet spot underneath your dick? Yeah, that was not fun. So I just rip it and I'm just like... Oh. <laughs> Mom! <laughs>